different ideas about what's, <laughs> what's <laughs> about what's sexy. This is about the blowjob, <laughs> isn't it? What, 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 what? what? I'm not blind. I saw that look in your eye in my office. What look? That judgmental look. No, no, that wasn't judgment. That was shock. Are you telling me you have no judgment about me and the Worldwide Express guy? <laughs> I did do it with a FedEx guy once, and that's why she's looking at me funny. I did it with a FedEx guy once. OK, we broke character. Go on. Uma M, I would love to hear the story about how Andy and SJP met. I just, I just told this story to somebody. Oh, you did? Yeah. Um, well, you were a segment producer. Oh, right, For yes. CBS yes. Morning News. Yeah. Or CBS This Morning, right? Yeah, yeah. And um, you were producing my segment, and I was late, uncharacteristically late. late. Yes. Very late, like unbelievably like, late. Like literally, I was waiting in like, front like, of 57th three, Street. Two. I was like, we are taking you right in. Yeah. And you were like, I'm so sorry, I'm never late, I'm never late, I'm never late. <laughs> and it was like 1992, um, and Carrie Dragshaw can't believe this story. <laughs> I am. And it was like 1992, and I was like, we History. ran upstairs, we I ran you into the thing. Nick, like, Harry Smith I interviewed you. I think I was talking about, was about UNICEF. UNICEF. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. And we ran you right in. And then we have mutual friends, and then, as I told somebody recently, then we started going on theater dates. Remember those theater yes. dates? Yes. Yeah, yeah. Just you and me. Dream dates. I spent a decent amount of time telling you to... Quiet. Speak a little more quietly. Yes. <laughs> so if all the bi kids are jumping off the bridge, you're going to do that too? Uh, <clears throat> you know, I did the whole date the bisexual guy thing in college, but in the end, they all ended up with men. Which explains why there is nobody available for us. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not even sure bisexuality exists. I think it's just like this layover on the way to gay town. Isn't that right next to Ricky Martinville? <laughs> <laughs> Your last question comes from Cynthia Nixon. Oh, my God. What is the most annoying thing about your best friend, Andy Cohen? <laughs> oh, are we best friends? I like it. Of course. Yes, yes. Well, well I, I was we saying were. that. Well, I was saying that. No, I know. I you have a lot of best friends. You have a lot of best friends. No, it's cool. It's cool. OK, sometimes if you're on the phone with Andy, you know if he gets busy doing something else, but he's so He's such a good friend that he wants to be with you and that other thing at the same time. But it, there's a, a weird kind of silence that, yeah. that, that it, 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 it almost like is deafening. Yeah. And, uh, you, and Hickey would say, <laughs> he would say uh, are, what are you doing? What are you yes. doing? And the other day, I finally said you to you. You called me on it the I other go, day. You did. What, what are you doing? And I did cop to it. But I don't mind because a phone call with you is really fantastic. Like, you get so much done. Thank you. I mean, uh, the stuff that's important and not, like yeah. value and yeah. just candy. Guess what? What? You didn't plead the fit. Oh, my Give God. Give it up for Sean, Heidi Hall, and Chelsea Pierce. And um, SJ follows Carrie Dragshaw on Instagram. I do. And, and, and Carrie Dragshaw, can I say, is Dan yeah. Clay. Oh, God. And <laughs> it's what, what you have done, what she, he, Shim has done oh, today man. is nothing. If you go look at Dan's Instagram page, it's kind of staggering what he does. Thanks for watching. Watch more clips here and subscribe to our channel here. See ya.